narcissists are desperate for attention. They are desperate for people to take notice of them. They are desperate for people to regard them as interesting or important. It makes them feel as though they are something valuable and significant. Attention has become the most valuable resource in today's world and people will do anything to get it. It has become more valuable than money or success. For many businesses, attention is essential to their survival. So there is no money or success without people's attention. But people who are seeking your attention are usually the ones who have the least to give. And that is why they are seeking your attention. Because you have something that they want, which they are trying to take from you. But people who are desperate for attention really have very little to give to you. They engage in attention-seeking behaviours because deep down they feel as though they are not enough. So they engage in these behaviours in an attempt to establish some level of significance in the situation or environment. Narcissists need constant attention and admiration. They need people to regard them as impressive or worthy of respect. They need people to approve of them. They need people to view them as something desirable or attractive. They feel dead without it. Getting attention and validation is their main priority. There is nothing more significant or important. Everything they do is self-serving. Everything they do is designed to gain them attention. It's all that really matters to them and they will do whatever it takes to get it. Attention has a very strong effect on the narcissist. For a moment, it makes them feel alive. but they can't get enough of it. They are never satisfied. They always want more and they will do whatever it takes to get it. In their pursuit of attention, the narcissist will engage in irrational and immoral behaviors. They will act in very foolish and unwise ways without showing any care for the consequences of their actions. Because all they can think about is what they need in that moment, which is attention. They are attention junkies. The focus always has to be on them. And that is why you will notice whenever you are engaged in something, they will always interrupt you. They always need your time and attention to be on them. When you are having a conversation with them, they will always interrupt you. They will always change the topic to something about themselves. Because the only thing they're interested in is attention. People taking notice of them. regarding them as something interesting or important, desirable and attractive. And if people don't notice or regard them in this way, or if they believe that someone has outshined them, they will be quick to insult people before they even know them, because they expect people to only focus their attention on them even though they have no real qualities or abilities. Even though they have nothing that is even worthy of anyone's attention. 
they demand and expect it just because they want it. Narcissists are desperate for attention and they don't want to wait to receive it. When they want something, they want it now. And this creates so many problems for them in work and relationships. Because those things take time to build. It's not something that develops overnight. And when you try to rush the process, you end up with something that has a weak foundation and structure. Something that is easily damaged and liable to collapse under pressure. Because these things take time. But narcissists don't want to wait. They need attention. They need instant gratification. And this often results in them finding themselves in undesirable situations due to irrational thinking and attention-seeking behaviours which they never take responsibility for. So it just repeats the cycle. They do the same things again and again expecting a different result. But they never find what they were looking for. They're never satisfied. Because they don't want to invest their time and energy over a long period of time. Which means that they never get to experience love. Because love takes time to build. They just want attention. They want instant gratification. Anything that takes time or where they have to wait. It only causes them to feel bored, disgusted or sexually repelled. They don't want things to happen slow. It makes them anxious. They want it right now. If you want to wait, if you understand that anything of real significance or value takes time to build, in their minds, you're just causing a disturbance or problem. You're just disrupting the flow of how it's supposed to be. Because in today's society, it is generally accepted that everything is supposed to happen quickly. There is no need to wait for anything. When you want it, you can get it. Which makes people very entitled. It makes people believe that they are inherently deserving of privileges or special treatment. As though they should expect to have whatever they want, whenever they want it. Instead of desperately seeking attention, 
and instant gratification. Instead of always wanting more and never being satisfied with anything they have, they should learn to practice gratitude. They should learn to be thankful. Because it is very easy to take things for granted, especially when they are given to you so readily and quickly. When you feel entitled and you receive things so fast and without taking the time to be grateful and thankful and to appreciate what you have, it can almost feel like you never received anything. Because they're too busy thinking about what's next. They're too busy waiting on the next thing and the next thing. And it just never stops. But they're never grateful for anything that they've received. The only time they ever realize what they had is when it's taken away from them or when they see it with someone else. But by that time, they're too busy being angry and resentful at the thing than to realize and accept everything that was done for them. Everything that they were given. Because they were never really grateful for what they had received. They took it for granted. And the only time they really recognize its worth is when it's no longer around. As the old saying goes, you don't know what you got until it's gone. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonates with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at maxwellcoaching at gmail.com. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.